Okay, so let's just say, for example, you are trying to sell a piece of property, maybe get it refinanced, maybe even you're buying it. Well, why don't you go out there and instead of having someone go out there and walk all the property, and then if you look, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, holy crap, you got a bunch of houses and a bunch of roofs that you have to climb up on. So why not go out there and have a 4K HD map rendering and inspection done for you? Again, as with all our maps, you can see that the actual plotted area is, you can see with the difference, it is overlaid on top of Google Maps. And we're gonna go out here, we're gonna zoom right in so you can tell the difference between your two mile up Google Earth and something that's flying at 150 feet. Oh my God, you can go out there and almost feel the electricity coming through those wires. Oh, look at that. You can almost see the mushrooms need the problem over here. Yes, we did have some rain that week before we came out. But here literally within 24 hours, and instead of taking a team, of God knows how many people, and to do all these, it would take at least a week to get up there and walk all these roofs and see what's going on and try to go ahead and use this. Go ahead and have this flown over. Let's go out there and make a visual rendering. You can go out there and take a look at the property. You can see we got a relatively new HD roof over here, old one. And these are in pretty decent shape. Oop, there's someone else that's got an older roof. A couple of people have gone out there and uh, redone some of these roofs. That looks like an original roof. You can also see the condition of the streets. And this thing looks like it was actually laid in cross sections. Like, so if you ever had to dig it up quickly or whatever, um, you could, because uh, it's done in sections. Interesting. But anyway, you can go out there and take a look at your streets back up. Look, we can see someone's got solar panels installed here. And we can see, oh, there's some indication that we've got uh, a block drainage pipe for AC underneath there. And it happens to probably be rusting the... Uh, drain pan and then leaking out into the roof so that's been out there for a while again just it's an indication not saying anything is going on these roofs look in pretty decent shape look here's a really crappy patch job wow look at that well obviously no one really give a crap about what they put up there but i mean look at that you can see yeah anyway again so you can go out there and see that granted you, you would see this with a manual walk up but why not have this right at your roof now oh, there's another one of those really bad leaky uh, and rusting drain pans but take a look at this there's some really nice roofs oh but you can see look you could tell that there's something wow all these houses one two three four five six of them in a row uh seems like to be a man a problem with the uh with the, the drains not being open and clogging up and then rusting the um the drain pan that's out there it's indicative of an of an uh, a problem that you may want to take care of might be worth looking into is what i'm trying to say and you can find that here right away from and then here you go let's find out how, how you know good, good this is there's me there my bald head sitting down there going out there you can almost see the map that's out there in the tablet that's how accurate this thing is you can go out there and see what's going on now also too if you were the landscaper and you were trying to figure out as you see this was taken on uh, May the 7th. Let's look at a couple of things that you can do. You can look at the plant health of the stuff that's out there. I'm telling you, this stuff has, does, you know, it looks like in pretty decent shape. All the dark red stuff is all dead because you can see that that's, there's roofs and parking lot. But I mean, for, for the most part, looks like a lot of these people are taking care of their, their property. Which is good because that means they're taking care of some stuff. Maybe some common areas that could use some some attention, but not bad. Just look at a click, click of a button, you can figure that out. Take a look at what's going on. You can also then, if you wanted to, if you're looking at this, this is great, especially for your insurance. Just say for an example, yeah, you went out there and this is great. Um, you got the property. You showed this to your lender. Your lender loved the great investment for what's going on. Now you bring it to your insurance guy and they want to know what the type of condition is. Well, you can go out there and give that to them. This is actually two good things. First of all, they'll be able to help the condition uh, for your um, insurance adjuster so you can figure out what's going on. But also then too, you've got a permanent copy of the condition of all these roofs before any type of disaster happens, whether it be natural like a tornado um, or something where there's a fire that causes an issue along the way. But if I happen to go out here and I were to follow this and um, 
map this out six months later, which is what I recommend with my clients. So you can figure out if there's any problems. You can identify them before they turn into major problems. But if you did, you can go out here and click on the start button, uh, the side by side. And being as the our time and date stamp, then you would have another map to choose from. You can slide it back and forth and determine um, what, if anything, was different that you can see what's going on. Cool part about this is, is that literally for another $100, I can go out there. You can get a roof report from what's going on, which also can give you um, dimensions, number of shingles that you need, pitches, etc. I mean, everything. So you don't have someone trying to go out there and tell you what the heck you needed. All this stuff is shareable as well. So all you have to do is you just click on the share button. You see there's two people here watching this as well. You can invite them to share the project and they can go out there and explore it as well. And then you can export all the information on the PDF maps and JPEG maps, et cetera. Uh, you can also then have an elevation map that's out there. But what's really cool about this is let's just take this and now we get to turn it into a 3D model. So what we're gonna do is we got HD over here. We're gonna let it start rendering. And then as soon as this little, you can see it's starting to develop over there. But as soon as this blue streak stops going by that we know what's going on, you can see it how it's putting it together, really cool. It's amazing that you can sit there with the 3D quality of this stuff. Uh, when I'm at 150 feet with just you know, taking pictures and then uh, doing just an extended type facade. I didn't really go up and down the streets or anything uh, to take uh, the stuff in, in between. But, I mean, just look at this. A map, uh, a model that you can see what your neighborhood looks like. You can actually start walking through it if you wanted to. You know, right down the street, you can see the condition of this stuff. back it away, move it around. I mean, just the, the detail, this is just phenomenal. And again, this isn't even as good as it could get. This is just a quick rendering um, when I shot this so I could show the capability to the person who owns this property, determine if that is you know, something that he wanted to do. But just absolutely amazing. This can be shared as well. Cool part about this, everything that we're talking about um, is there is no monthly subscription for this. It's all inclusive in the price. So it's just one price for every time that it's flown over and take a, a visual inspection and you provide the deliverable to you. Cool part about this is if you'd like to have one of these things done for you or you want to discuss what uh, can be happened, please, here's my email address, Mike at MikeSipPhotography.com. Drop me a line. Be glad to sit there and give you a personal demonstration, talk to you about all the stuff and figure out how this might be able to uh, help you and or your company. Appreciate your time. See you later.